your leading at gabay tungo sa tagumpay. Sa isang bansang makabata, batang makabansa. Maraming sa... Ma'am Felicidad D. Zacarias To our ever-supportive barangay officials headed by our barangay captain Honorable Nolly B. Tamayo To our guest speaker, ma'am To our school faculty and staffs, parents, friends, and fellow completers A pleasant morning to all of us Completion is one of the most significant events to a junior high school student's life Though another stage of our education ends, it brings us a mixture of joy and pain. Joy for successfully overcoming another chapter of our student's life. Pain because we are saying goodbye to those people who became part of our lives. I would say that this school year is indeed the hardest in our junior high school journey. We all know that we've been stuck for two years because of the pandemic. As I witnessed this year's completion ceremony, I can't help but to think about the hardships that our batch went through. All the sleepless nights, how we starved ourselves just to finish our subjects and the judgment from others. Despite those adversities, we stood up and bravely carried our way to the end. Instead of losing hopes and giving up, it made us stronger and wiser. To my fellow completers, we are about to enter another journey, the senior high school. We will be facing another battle, but I know that we can win this no matter what. Always remember that there is no reason to fear what the future holds. In fact, the future is in our own hands. It is up to us on how we will deal with it. To our dear parents and honored guests, on behalf of the great 10 completers of the school year 2022-2023, it is my pleasure to welcome you all to witness us march on this stage one by one to receive our awards and diplomas. Some of us may still be together in senior high school, and others might opt to enroll at different school of their choice for various reasons. But don't be sad of the concept of separation. Just like BTS, who are separating ways to grow individually as a solo artist, we are separating ways to walk to the roads to our dreams. So sit back and relax as we witness this year's completion ceremony. Once again, good morning. Uh, speaks kanina ni Madam Ms. Marcos. Uh, natatandaan ko yung sinabi niya, that your future should not be determined by you. Okay. May kasabihan na nasa Diyos ang awa, nasa tao ang gawa. So your future is still dependent, dependent on the great architect of the universe. Na yun po yung ating Panginoon. So good, again, good luck po sa inyo. <coughs> Naalala ko ka, well, actually, May kwento ko lang, ano, kung gaano ko kinibigyan ng value nitong moving up ceremony. Because while well ago, I was in a cert. Iniisip ko, nakakaya naman na ako'y humarap sa mga magulang. And at the same time, ang mga tutungo sa mas mataas na antas ng pag-aaral na ako'y nakatisip lamang. So agad-agad, nung malaman ko na Meron pa lang moving up ceremony, ako'y agad na nagbihis. That is, ang ibig pong sabihin yan ay pagbibigay ng value at importance yung paghihirap at pagsisikap ninyo sa katagumpay ng inyong narating na ito. Okay? So, kaya mataya po because uh, kung gaano man uh, kahihirap ang ating dinanan because of the pandemic, narating po natin itong tagumpay na ito. At hindi lang po sana, inaasahan ko, alam po ninyo, 
Last week, last Friday yata, dalawang magkasunod, may kwento ko lang sa inyo. May tumawag sa akin, nagpapasalamat, hindi ko na matandaan. So sinasabi niya, salamat na ang kapitan, sabi niya, salamat sa naitulong mo. Sino ka ako sa lublog ko? Sino kaya ito? Pwede bang mag-usap tayo ng personal? Lang nandito po kami sa opisina ngayon. Iyon pala, yung nakikiusap po sa atin noon na mag-aral siya at nakatapos and at that, naging magna kung laude. So sana, sa pagsisikap ninyo, ganun po sana ang mangyari din sa inyo. Hindi dahilan yung paghihirap upang makatapos ng pag-aaral. Pagsisikap at determinasyon and at the same time, enthusiasm. Kung sino ang pwede niyong lapitan para makatulong at makapag-aaral kayo, huwag kayong mahihiyang lumapit lalong-lalo sa inyong mga magulang. Ang, well, we have different resources. Napakaraming resources ngayon ng gobyerno upang makapagtapos sa pag-aaral ang inyong mga anak. Huwag lang kayong mahihiya. Well, there, there are different stories na nabigyan na ng pagkakataon na makapag-aral ng isang anak. Nag-aral, libre lahat, and suddenly, well, siguro hindi naman sinasabi sa kahirapan dahil nagbibigay naman. Biglang umuwi yung bata at kinalimutan na niya mag-aral. Sayang yung mga pagkakataon ng So we should encourage, motivate ang ating mga ang ating mga anak para mag-aral sila dahil yun lang ang makakatubo sa atin ng kahirapan. Huwag natin pabayaan maging mangmang tayo at ang ating mga anak dahil iba na po ang panahon ngayon. Kung wala kang anak sa batas, kawawa ka. Hindi mo alam ang inyong karapatan. So education is very important. So, again, I encourage to each and other one of you, lalong-lalo na sa inyong mga magulang, na disenta yung mga teachers sa, sa inyong pagsisikap upang magandang ninyo ang inyong tagumpay. Again, good luck and best, best wishes to all of you, lalong-lalo na sa mga graduates, for your ascendancy sa inyong pag-aaral. Thank you very much at maraming salamat. and 25 females with a total of 56 learners. I hereby petition the office of the school principal to certify the completion of the requirements of these candidates. Ma'am? School principal, Ma'am Felicidad Sakarias. School Principal 2 of Luna General Comprehensive High School through her duly authorized representative. Ma'am, after careful scrutiny of the requirements submitted to the school checking committee and validated by the division checking committee, this division it is found and hereby attested that these learners Department of Education through Dr. Rachel Ariana, Sesofied Schools Division Superintendent of SDO Isabella, having been presented by your advisor and duly certified by the master teacher that you have satisfactorily completed all the basic requirements prescribed by the Department of Education under the K-12 Basic Education Curriculum. I now confirm you, completers of Luna General Comprehensive High School for the school year 2022-2023. Palaktakan po natin siya. Jeffrey A. Rivera Jemar B. Aban Harana Luna Isabella The son of Mr. and Mrs. Jerry M. Aban Melchor 
Mercia Benes with Samantha Luna Isabella, the son of Mr. and Mrs. Ramil M. Abenes. Don Carlos I. Alcawili, Mababaka Luna Isabella, the son of Mr. Elmer S. Chris Jewel M. Duran with high honors. She will also Yes. Sure.